Tonight, the Chicago Theater of the Air presents Giacomo Puccini's famous grand opera, La Tosca. Starring in the title role is our lovely prima donna, who now makes her first entrance of the evening, Miss Marion Clare. In the role of the painter, Mario Cavaradossi, the new sensational tenor of the Metropolitan Opera Company, Mr. Richard Tucker. <laughs> Supporting artists Bruce Foot and Carol Smith and a cast of more than 100 take places on stage. The Chicago Theater of the Air, conducted by Henry Weber, presents La Tosca. <laughs> the high vaulted interior of the Church of St. Andrea, sacred shrine of heaven and eternal sanctuary of all mankind. And behold the artist, Mario Cavaradossi, who has set up his easel at the side of the altar and busily paints a fair-haired, blue-eyed Madonna, using as his model an unsuspecting woman kneeling a short distance from him. But Mario Cavaradossi's thoughts are not on the portrait before him. In his mind's eye, he sees his sweetheart, Floria Tosca. La Tosca, the great prima donna, La Tosca, the Irresistible. Angelotti, my old friend Angelotti. I can hardly believe my eyes. Mario Cavardos, never have I been as glad to see anyone. The heavens must have sent you to me. My friend, you wear the garb of prison. Angelotti, you have escaped. I have escaped but now from Fort San Angelo. My life is in danger. You must hide. Can I help you? Oh, you. oh Flora is looking for me. Conceal yourself. Gloria Tosca. The most jealous of women. I cannot make her a part of your escape. I understand now. I cannot impose upon you, Mario. I will take my chance alone. I will... No, wait. Huh? Here. The key to my villa. Go there and wait until I can make further plans for you. Mario, you are indeed my true friend. Thank you and God bless you.
someone else was whispering with you. Where is she? Oh, the girl you were concealing. I heard the swish of skirts and the patter of her footsteps. No. Just a woman I found here in the church. I used her as a model. I... Hmm. She's pretty. Too pretty. Gloria, please believe me. I... I... She... She... Why are you so suspicious? Oh, don't you think I have reason to be? Why was I 
Yes, my Florian. I pledge to love you until I die. Are you content to leave me with my painting now? Oh, yes, I will go. My love for you is greater than my common sense, I fear. But the next time you paint a Madonna, see that her eyes are dark like mine. Ah, uh, me. I should be grateful that my Florey is jealous, I suppose. Proves her love for me. And I love her too much to tell her about Angelotti. Cannot expose her to such danger. I must help him alone. I'm a... Oh, Mario. Mario, I dare not leave the church now. My escape has been discovered. The cannon spreads the alarm. We cannot stay here, Angelotti. Come. I will take you to my villa by a back route. Police or no police, I won't forsake a friend. Behold now the most dreaded figure in all Rome, standing before Mario's half-finished painting at the church. The wily Scarpia, minister of police, has tracked Angelotti well. It's apparent that Cavaradotti left his painting hurriedly. I wager his hurry was caused by the appearance of Angelotti. Mario. If I... Who is this? Mario, I came back for a moment of... Oh. Ah, the lovely Madame Tosca. Signor Scarpia, your excellency. I... I expected to find... Ah, it's quite useless. I just this moment saw Signor Cavaradotti leave the church with that lovely young lady. You... You saw... Oh, no. Why, it's impossible. He, he swore to me that no woman was... Was it the, the girl in his painting here? The same. Beautiful, is she not? I... He deceived me. If I find them together, I... I'll bring down a curse on them. I... Ah, careful, careful, Madame Tosca. You're in church. Curses are hardly appropriate. I'll find them. I'll find them if I have to search every corner of Rome. <laughs> Follow that woman. Highly probable that where she goes, you'll find Mario Cavaradotti and our escaped prisoner, Angelotti. She will not be out of my sight, Your Excellency. <sighs> Policeman's fate is kind on occasion. Such fate has led me on a prisoner's trail straight to the arms of the enchanting Tosca. Ah, ironic. Good. Choristers even now gathering for holy communion. No feeling in my soul but an overwhelming desire to destroy the artist Cavaradotti and to possess La Tosca for my very own. Such an invitation from fate I cannot ignore. Are you 